really scares me. I think if I had to pick an all-time scariest movie, I think I would say the first Alien. Love that movie. The first Alien movie, that is a scary is movie. Scary. It's very different than all the other Alien movies. Because in all the other Alien movies, the aliens are kind of out in the open and, and you shoot a bunch of them. They're yeah. coming from all over the place. It's m way unrealistic, yeah. by the way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, I, we can get into that. H have you seen the documentary of the making of Alien? I have, it's, yeah. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, it's amazing, yeah. That uh, HR, how do you say his name? Geiger? Yeah, I HR think that, Geiger, that sounds the, right. the, yeah. the artist that the designed artist, it. Yeah. Oh my God. It's unbelievable. What a unique vision. <laughs> Unreal. Like the the strange, his art was so strange. And yeah. that creature that he created was amazing. Yeah, yeah. It was literally like the ultimate terrifying alien predator. And a, f a feminist empowerment because the alien is a female. Oh, the big one. The mother. The remember? mother is the a girl. One? Yeah. But this movie is so fucking good. Yeah. It's so good. And it's so scary. It's a great sci fi movie, but it's also fucking scary. Yeah. Like, like you're talking about being startled. Yeah, yeah. Like, and that that alien in this movie is elusive and intelligent, and traps people. Yeah. And 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 you you get to see it in brief glances, and yeah. then in the new movies after that, like they like aliens, it's kind of a different things going on because you yeah. can kill them easy. Yeah, now yeah. You're just blasting yeah, a bunch yeah. of them, and then the mother's at you, but you got a robot body, yeah. so you're all good. Like it's just so much ridiculousness that it just hurts my feelings. Have you ever, have you ever seen 1980 Brian De Palma's Dress to Kill, which is kind of a precursor to all the transgender stuff that we hear today? Have you seen that movie? No. Oh, it's fantastic. Michael Caine, Angie Dickinson, 